Hello everybody, and welcome to Striker Plays The Banner Saga. Uh, basically, I'm going to do a playthrough of The Banner Saga with you guys. I have done a uh, first impressions slash first strike video um, on it, which you can check out on my channel if you're interested in finding out more about the actual mechanics and uh, details about the game. This is purely going to be a playthrough, and I hope you enjoy. There will be some dodgy voice acting by me. And uh, I know before we start, the actual voice acting in the game doesn't have any subtitles, but there's not much of it, so I'll shut up through the cutscenes. And yes, I've only played about uh, half an hour ish to do my first strike video, so I'm going to just restart it. And uh, let's go on an adventure. The story in the Banner Saga changes based on the choices you make. You are occasionally switched between lead characters, witnessing the story unfold from different perspectives. The gods are dead. In their wake, man and giant survived through a tenuous alliance, driving black destroyers called Dredge deep into the northern wastes. Now is an era of growth and trade. Life goes on. Only one thing has stopped. The sun. And here we go. Stoic Games presents... Zipana Saga. This is a bit where I shut up. Að sjá dreggjan á ferli meðar vor. It has been several long months on the road. The first signs of snowfall accost us on our approach to Strand, largest of the trade cities on the Val human borders, and our last collection before returning to the capital. Several days ago, the sun simply came to a stop in the sky. Though during these long winter days, none of us can be certain how long it has been this way. Some of the men in the caravan have taken it as a dire omen. I am not quick to superstition, but I myself will be glad to be done with this year's rounds. We have been warned by stranded travelers about brigands on the path through Richhorn, our road home. Our captain seems unconcerned. Perhaps he is as eager as I to be done here. We will rest here this day and inquire further when we speak to the governor. I'm going to skip through all the tutorial bits because um, I know what I'm doing, basically, sort of, not really, as you'll see. Uh, but yeah, if you want to find out more about the tutorial and, like I said, how the game mechanics work, check out my first strike video and uh, you shall see. Blah, 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 blah. I'm going to move there, do that. Is there like hot burning coals in the middle? What's that all about? It's very dangerous. Smash this guy in the noggin. Yes, please, let me smash him. Gosh darn it! Smash him in the face. Boom! You got stabbed! Oh, look at this guy. Thinks he can. Oh, oh, one damage. Ah, oh, the pain. Ah, oh, no. Look at all these people watching, man. So many of them. They could, uh. They could do something about these guys, surely. Boom! <laughs> Dump! Pillage mode activated. Cool. Let's finish this off. And I can get onto my cheesy voice acting. <laughs> Feels a bit of willpower. And stabbed. Right onto the hot coals. Boom. The foes lying dead. Oh. Okay. 
Well, like a rabid wolf, that one. How did it come to this? We fool ourselves believing that peace will last. My grandfather built all this from a poor fishing village, you know. He watched the gods die, watched the chaos that followed, watched man and var slaughter each other, even before the dreads arose. All we've done is traded one struggle for another. Now that there are no more dreads to war against, we war against ourselves. This chieftain meant to kill me, and he's not the first. A dozen families in the city would gladly take my chair. This one had men waylaying merchants, both north and south of the city, strangling trade quite well, I would add, though he denied it to his lust. This sort of wolf doesn't stop biting because the head is cut off. It just grows a new head. I am in a bad way, my friend. Help me finish this fight, and I'll gladly send you on your way with double our king's tithe. Take any men you need. They're loyal. I promise you that. They will meet you down in the proving grounds. Right, well, there we go. Lots of death and destruction already. Chapter 1. Only the sun has stopped. Which sounds lovely. So... You were approached by a familiar man who walks in step with you as you are leaving the Great Hall. He cuts to the chase. As you'll find out, I'm not very good at reading, so uh, <laughs> I'll probably get better as it goes on. Uh, I'll attempt to do voices for people, but uh, uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Elick, steward of Strand. I manage the governor's business. Ubin, isn't it? It is. The governor tells me you'll be give you'll see what I mean. <laughs> you'll be giving us a hand. Hmm. What did you have in mind? Scafflings that you didn't hack up in the great hall scattered after you took out their chieftain. The governor just wants to make sure they all stay down. Was hoping you'd join me at the marketplace by the docks. If there's anyone left to worry about, I know who can tell us. Yeah, I promise I'll get better at reading as we go on. <laughs> Let's head off to the market. And uh, see what Eric has in mind. Let me handle this. You meander through rows of open-faced houses and eroded stools. Coloured... can spell wrong. Uh, canvases flap on a briny current. One man in particular... Blanches as you approach. Had, I'm not in the mood today. For, for, for what? Talking to an idiot. The scaffolding's chieftain bled out about an hour ago, Had. So when you tell me what the... Mm, damn it. Uh, so when you tell me what rat anus the rest of them crawl back into, nobody's going to try and kill you this time. I... I don't talk to... they don't talk to me. Eric, need some help here? Had I had a change of heart, I hope you do give us a hard time. Had sweats visibly fumbling with some dirty trinkets on his table which he doesn't seem to have but anyway wait just just buy one of these if everybody thinks i'm getting worked over every week how am i supposed to know much just a little food money yeah i shall pay him you toss a sliver of silver on the table both men look at you with a surprise had gestures meekly to a variety of junk from his stool. Take whatever you like. Only one thing I'd like is the name of a place. Nobleman, up by East Wall. But that was months ago, last I know. Had skulks away with a wave of Eric's hand. Gathering things from his hovel, 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 -de, uh, disappearing for a while until this blows over, you figure. Your bodyguard steps forward. Are we done here? 
Don't know. If, were you wearing black back at the green hall? Uh, green back at the great, great hall. <laughs> ah, I hate myself. The text is so small. It's so annoying. Um, no. Just bought them when you were when we were talking about walking around. Why? Um, well, you look like a frog. Better than an eggplant. Gunolf goes off to look at more stools. Eric! Who? Eric! Uh, the man of yours seems to be unreliable at best. A blind dog wouldn't trust Had, but he used to be scaffling. If they are licking their wounds, they've probably gone to old haunts, not to new ones. Nobleman in is a meat hall? Best I can tell, the name's ironic. Listen, I know a guy who would love to put a few of these skulls in the ground. I'm going to find him. I'll meet you there. Uh, shouldn't we have an approach of some sort? What a luxury. Come on, you've already mopped up worse today. Just make sure the governor remembers his promise. Double the usual tithe. Tith, tithe, tithe. I'll remind him. Right, the adventure continues to the meat house. You arrive in front of what must be a nobleman. A few, or be nobleman. A few minutes later, Eric appears with a weather-beaten man introduces Valgard. I'll point them out, Eric says over his shoulder. Ready? You're walking through the front door? They ran to a meat house, says Valgard. I'll be surprised if they can stand up straight right now. Okay, here we go. See, here we are. Doo -doo, doo -doo, doo -doo. Valgard boots the front door open so hard it won't close again without repair. As you enter the hall, Eric is already at the head of a table, his axe drawn. Wide-eyed, drunken scufflings scramble to, their own, to find their weapons, turning tables and meat steins in the process. Damn, dude. Here we go! Little more hot coals. What's this? They're boiling some scuff. Little open windows, guys. Invent glass. Anyway. Right, how do we want to go about doing this? How much health do you have? 10, 10, 8. This guy could probably handle. Mm, I'll send him down the middle. Maybe. Now, if he goes. Can you start? You go over there. Um, that probably makes sense to have a mix action. So I have a strong one and a weaker one here. And then vice versa on the other side. So, let's go. Boom! Battle commence! Hut, hut. Stone wall. Just in case. So I actually use a willpower point. Uh, seven out of six. What? I don't think it did. Who am I? I am you. Move. Let's go try and intercept this blokey. Can't actually attack him, can I? No. Oh, in turn. Here. That digital path. Didn't mean to do that. Oh well. I'll get used to it again. I haven't played it since the day it came out. <laughs> yeah, you guys don't know what's about to hit you. Seven. Jeez. Boom. <laughs> Dead. What? Oh, I went through him. That's incredible. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. Oh, oh, holy crap. Holy crap. Well, that was pretty ridiculous. Um, no, I mean, you can come down here. Might get in. No, actually. No, stop. 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 Back. <laughs> I was going to say, you might get in a bit of trouble. Let's just go finish this guy off. Don't want to isolate anyone. Boom. Uh, yeah, might as well do that. If I just... Let's just attack him. Waste them willpowers. 
bumps, bump, bumps, but the bumps, bump, bumps. Damn, dude, your attack is terrible, Eric. Um, I guess you might as well do some bloody armor damage. <laughs> Boom! Again, if you want to know about more about the mechanics, uh, basically it's armor and strength, and uh, or health, and the the strength is the health and the strength. So it depends. The lower your uh, strength, the less health you have, and the um, weaker you'll hit, or vice versa. And then the armor, the blue one, is literally just your armor. And if the armor is lower, then you can do uh, more damage to the opponent. Or if your armor is lower, then they can do more damage to you because it basically bypasses it. Makes sense, right? Let's get in here. And we can attack this mother. Do it for four. Dead. Stabbed. Awesome. Oh no, look at that guy. Oh no, what happened to him? Did I kill him? I don't think I killed him. And him. Ah, what about Mr. Piggy? That's one fat pig. Anyway. Uh, I would like to attack you, sir. I don't know how much... Uh, Tempest isn't going to hit. Huh. Let's just try this quick. Ha! <laughs> incredible! <laughs> that was incredible. I love that. Uh, you're going to attack this. I... I'm sure I attacked you last time. Uh, we're just attacking five. Use those willpowers in a minute. Oh, look at that joker. Uh, you can go... Probably, no, you're probably best off coming down here, actually. Doodaloo! What's Rally do? Give two willpower points to an enemy. Uh, he's got six, he's got seven. Nah, we won't bother. Attack this guy. Get his armor down. Pow! Oh no, one damage. The pain. So yeah, range. Uh, move you there. This is kind of where it gets annoying where you can't move the camera. All you can do is um. You can only move it like that. You can't actually speak to him. zoom it in, which is rather annoying. Please leave him alone. Holy mojo. That wasn't very nice, was it? But now you're going to get demolished. Boom. Look at that. Uh, oh, wow. I need to get him out of there. Crap. 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 Might as well kill this guy. No! No, don't do that! Oh! oh, bad things have happened. I should have gone and saved him. I didn't think that was going to happen. Uh, well, yeah, that was pretty pathetic, really, wasn't it? Ah, crap. Eric's dead. But he's not written. Um, they basically need time to heal. Your renown grows. Promotion for gun off! Yay! Damn, 10 right now. Look at that. 